Welcome back to the Michigan Business Beat, brought to you on the Michigan Business Network. Chris Holman here, broadcasting from remote today. And I think you're becoming more familiar with this setting than our actual studio in downtown. But, you know, we have to move around a little bit. We're going to run over to the west side of the state right now and spend a little time with Jennifer DeMud from Michigan Celebrates Small Business. She's the board chair and executive director also of Manufacturing Growth Alliance. And uh, Jen, it's very good to see you this morning. And uh, I'm I'm surprised you have time for us, quite frankly. Oh, Chris, we always make time for Chris Holman and the Michigan Business Network. We appreciate the collaboration and the friendship, gosh, for well over a decade. Well, I, I, I have to tell you that that makes me feel really important because I know how your time is stretched right now. And most of it is because of the Michigan Celebrate Small Business situation. But before we get there, I, I want you to kind of reiterate to our audience, um, uh, you know, about the uh, Manufacturing Growth Alliance and, and what, what you folks do. Yeah, so the Manufacturing Growth Alliance is a membership-based organization that supports second stage manufacturers all across the state. We help them shore up their internal operations and position them for growth moving forward. Well, you do a tremendous job and, and you're doing a great job over there as the director, by the way. Still a kind of a new position, isn't it? It's a less than a year, I think. Actually, Chris, uh, you know, over the past two years, it's gone by so fast that um, I've been with the Manufacturing Growth Alliance for about 18 months now. Wow, that is pretty incredible. I didn't think it, uh, of course, you know, we've both been caught up with a lot of things. And, and one of those things is the Michigan Celebrate Small Business. So bring us up to date. This is kind of a critical stage right now. It's the nomination uh, time, is it not? Yes, yeah, so we are closing in on the window for individuals to nominate companies for the Michigan 50 Companies to Watch Award, as well as that Michigan 50 Distinguished Alumni Award. We have two of those uh, awards available. Hey, just for the sake of uh, our audience out there, what, what are the criteria? Uh, who, who is eligible to be nominated? Yeah, so for the Michigan 50 Companies to Watch Award, some basic criteria, six to 99 employees, FTE equivalent, 750,000 to 50 million in revenue, must be headquartered in Michigan. Uh, and we look for intent and capacity to grow in those applications. Absolutely. Well, it's good stuff. It really is. So uh, tell us the, about the cycle and, and what's taking place right now with the nominations. Who, who can nominate? Yeah, so small business supporters, community members, and we also accept, accept self-nominations. So pretty much anyone in Michigan can nominate. You know, don't be reluctant uh, to, to self-nominate because we have winners uh, in the past who have self-nominated sometimes that kind of thing just gets overlooked and you need to toot your own horn if you're doing well. Yeah, and what I've seen over the years, Chris, because I've been in it a few years, um, that departments will nominate the, their owner. So we'll see production supervisors and we'll see um, COOs nominate the company. So a lot of times that self-nomination will come from within the organization because the company gives back, they're on a growth path and they truly... Uh, appreciate being part of that company and they want to see the company celebrated for their successes. So it's not always the CEO, president, CEO, owner. A lot of times it's it's those team members that nominate. So uh, this also brings a great deal of pride when you win something like this. Um, and tell us a little bit about uh, an affair you had very recently uh, for, for the nominees. Yeah, so we just last evening, we had a nominee reception in East Town. We had a number of our small business nominees show up, learn more about the nomination, application, judging process. And it was such a dynamic and energetic evening. Uh, of course, we all love small business. So I had a lot of great conversation with a lot of nominees. And I'm telling you, the excitement for Michigan Celebrates and this, this awards gala that we have in May, it's percolating, it's bubbling up, and there's a lot of excitement building. Yeah, I have to say the networking is one of my favorite parts of that evening when you get around. And, you know, though it was a Michigan Celebrates small business evening, I, I have to say that one of the things we did was uh, talk about and toast the outgoing director, mm -hmm. uh, executive director of the Small Business Association of Michigan, Rob Fowler. Um, who 
incidentally, along with me, uh, we're kind of the last men standing from the original founders. So now I'm the lonely guy. Yeah, Rob, Rob has been a gem um, to Michigan and to the small business community. Um, sad to see him retire um, from SBAM. We know that Brian Kelly is going to do an amazing job. And I also have to say, Chris, too, I, I, can, I can say those same things uh, for you. I know you're not retiring, but you're a gem to our small business community in Michigan as well. Um, well you're, being, you're being far too kind, and I think you're wrong for the first time in your life. <laughs> um, there, there are some dates that we should know very quickly on the way out in regards to nominations, et cetera. Nominations close November 22nd. If you've been nominated, we have an application that is due on December 6th. We will go through judging all through December and January, and our companies will be notified by the end of February. So get to it, folks. If you know of a company, get that nomination in. And, and, and how should they nominate? What's the procedure? They, should they send you something? Well, I, I always entertain uh, and respond to emails, but the best way is to go to michigancelebrates.org. The button is on the landing page. Click it. It takes 42 seconds to nominate a company. There you go. michigancelebrates.org. Jennifer DeMud, thank you. And thanks for all you have done to heighten the uh, profile of this Michigan Celebrate Small Business Celebration. And thank, thanks back to you, Chris. Thanks for you. And also, by the way, Jennifer, you can catch her show right here on the Michigan Business Network. I'm Chris Holman. You're watching the Michigan Business Beat on the Michigan Business Network. We'll be back with you.